everybody, this is a tutorial on how I made a decision maker using the Snap Circuits D Lock Snap Rover and the Snap Circuits Micro Sat. And this was all my own idea. Here's how I did it. As I previously mentioned, this is all my own idea. I am using a pickaxe microcontroller. It's under there. And a, the Snap Circus D Lock Snap Rover. And the reason for this is the pickaxe microcontroller has to be run off of a voltage around 4.5 volts. And this is the battery box for it. I wanted to make it, the decision maker say, actually say yes when the green LED that symbolizes yes glowed. And so I had a sound recording device and I programmed into it the sound say yes and but it needs nine volts and so I put it on the snap rover body which has nine volts in it. This glows green when it says yes and this glows red when outputs no. I made up the flow chart in the programming editor and so is random. When you press this button, it inputs into the pickaxe and it rolls random and glow makes one of these LEDs glow. And if this one glows, then this says, and if this one glows, this one just glows. And you see here there's a transistor, and that is used for when on the base of the transistor, it outputs yes here, the input to the transistor, the collector, is the sound recording device's positive voltage, which is 9 volts, and then the output goes to the sound and recording device's play pin, and here is a pull-down resistor that keeps it low when this is low. Let's see how it works, shall we? As you may realize, there are two on-off switches here. And you may be wondering, well, why is that? Well, as I previously mentioned, the sound recording device has to have 9 volts and the pickaxe has to have four and a half volts. So this switch, when you turn it on, it turns on the random module. And then you have to turn this on so you can hear the yes whenever this glows. And before I turn the sound recording device on, I must note something that when I turn it on, it always says the program message. So it will likely say yes. Well, that is not always, but, and now I turn on this, and then it says that. Okay, now, when you press this button, it'll either output the red or the green. Let's see it work. There! It said no. And now, I have the program set up so that you press the button, and it keeps the selection until you press it again so that it keeps it, because that's helpful. There, now I'll press it again. And there! It is very random, I think, and you can hold it so that it cycles through it. And see? There's no, um, order that it goes in. It's totally random. And when that glows, it says yes. Thanks for watching.